Okay, so exercise for rotator cuff tendinopathy seems to be the most promising intervention, but there is lots that we don't know about. One aspect that interests me is how can we help patients to adhere to an exercise program? And I think there are some things that we need to consider. For example, monitoring exercise through an exercise diary, for an example, to use consultations to discuss barriers to exercise because a precursor to an effective therapeutic intervention has to be adherence. And we're starting to see a steer from the literature that suggests the more often people do their exercise, the better their clinical outcomes. How much they need to do their exercise is unclear, but from the studies we've seen so far, the more that people engage with their exercise program, the better they do, as long as we give them sufficient time. And my take home message really is that we've got to take exercise adherence seriously. And part of taking it seriously is monitoring, engaging with, it, with our patients and having discussions about how they've managed to form their exercise program. Having a great Congress. Thank you.